from Esgol Gevin Gymrai Glantav in Cardiff and we are here to have a look at one of Leadbitter's construction projects. Leadbitter started as a small family company in 1971 and now has eight regional offices across England and Wales. Their business is divided into two main areas. Affordable housing and major works which includes health, education, leisure and community buildings. Leadbitter have worked on many regeneration projects that include both of these elements. In Butetown in Cardiff, Leadbitter are developing the Loudoun Square regeneration project. Leadbitter are delivering the Loudoun Square scheme for Cardiff Community Housing Association. They are developing a new healthcare centre, which is the first healthcare project in Wales, to attain an excellent BRIAM rating for its sustainable design features. The BRIAM rating is the Building Research Establishment Environmental Assessment Method and the healthcare centre is the highest scoring building in Wales. As well as providing community housing, flats and a healthcare centre, they are also building retail units and a community hub. Could you explain what the Loughton Square Scheme is and what it hopes to achieve? The Loudoun Square scheme is the generation of this part of Cardiff on uh, Butte Street and what we're trying to do is improve all the facilities in this area. We've got a, a new healthcare unit going in which includes doctors, podiatry and dentistry. We've also got a community hub and hall so that we can have local events and the retail shops will all open up again with this new part of the development in much nicer facilities. At the same time we are providing housing, Code 4 and Code 5, which are very environmentally friendly housing, with 13 townhouses and also 48 apartments will be the final part of the development. So it completely encompasses everything that this area requires. Kieran Brown from Cardiff is in his third year of a bricklaying apprenticeship with Leadbitter. He has been employed to specifically work on the Loudoun Square Regeneration Project. In my apprenticeship it involves building brick walls, block walls, uh, building corners and putting windows and door frames in, levelling brickwork and blockwork and making sure it's all plumb straight. So far I've got uh, level 1 OCN in brickwork, abrasive wheels and MVQ level 2. In the first year I learned about different types of bricks, different types of blocks, insulation, wall ties, uh, levelling and plumbing. At the moment I'm learning to do decorative brickwork and decorative bonds. I enjoy working outside, working with different people in different environments, uh, doing physical work. Also for the company, the company is really good to work for and they're helping me get along in my career, get things started and get where I want to be in life. Kieran's been very, very valuable to me. Um, he's able to push on our subcontract brick, brick layers uh, to increase the speed of their work. Uh, and at the same time, he's able to do some jobs for me that may have been missed in a bricklayer's order. Uh, so to save adding it to their order uh, and costing us more money, Kieran is able to carry out them tasks more often than not. At the moment, we have approximately 70 personnel working on site through about 15 different subcontractors. Uh, they are working for people like roofers, uh, carpenters and bricklayers who everyone knows of through to more obscure trades like uh, the guys who put the lightning protection on the roof and the fire spray paint on the steel. Apprentices are our future tradesmen and women on site. Uh, almost everyone on site will have been an apprentice at some time. Uh, and these are the people that we rely on to build our projects to a high standard for years to come. So it's important that Leadbitter do their bit and help train these people. Leadbitter are committed to employing and training local people. They are also committed to making sure the community of Butetown benefits from the regeneration of Loudoun Square. Via a website dedicated to the development of the scheme, Local residents are invited to make suggestions for a new name for the completed buildings. They are also conducting a survey to see what the local residents feel about the community cinema. Well, that's it from us. Next up are pupils from Escola Bedouin in Bala, who are going to be visiting Williams Homes and Timber Frames to see what they specialise in.